Welcome back. When we found the area of triangles, we've looked at a variety of triangles. We started with a right triangle, where the base and the height were sides. Then we looked at triangles where the height was inside the triangle. Now we're going to look at some obtuse triangles. Sometimes the height will actually be outside of the triangle. In this case, it isn't possible to draw a line perpendicular to the opposite side that goes from this corner um, and hit the opposite side. So what we have to imagine doing is extending our side and then our height actually ends up being shown outside the triangle. So our height is four yards and our base is just that part of the triangle, which is 16 yards. Area equals one half times 16 times four. This triangle will have an area of 32 square yards. So again, if you're given multiple lengths, you need to make sure that the ones you're multiplying are the base and the height. So we're looking at the ones that form a right angle. I notice again that I have this measurement outside the triangle. Well, if I were to extend the length of this bottom, um, it would form a right angle with that 15 feet length. So that means that our six is the base, 15 is the height, and we're not gonna use 22 as we find the area. Our area is one half times six times 15 equals 45 square feet.